All right, what's up everyone? Hope you're all doing well. Like I said in my previous video, I am going to play the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Now, it's called the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I prefer that. Friday the 13th, the game. I thought it sounded a bit ridiculous. Just call it Friday the 13th. But anyways, yes, yeah, so if you haven't watched my previous video, uh, the one I made yesterday, um, you should probably check it out if you want to do like a little quick comparison. If you don't give a shit about Friday the 13th, then just stick to this one. That's completely fine. Now, I wanted to mention a few things. In the previous video, I mentioned that they were made by the same people. Uh, they're not. They're published by the same people, Gun Interactive. But Friday the 13th, the game was developed by Ilphonic. And the Texas Chainsaw Massacre was developed by Sumo Digital. So that's the little key difference here. Now... I looked at the tutorials and if you look around here, I thought they were going to be like something you would do, like play them, but it's mostly just like, it, it's just uh, a video with text and it shows you like different things. They're kind of long, so watching all of these takes a little while. Um, and strangely enough, the first one has voice, like voiceover, but the others don't. I don't know if that's an error. Uh, same thing for the family, so you know, you got your work cut out for you if you want to watch these, but they're useful, you know, but I've watched gameplay video before, so I am a, a little familiar with it. And, you know, there's progressions here, which I haven't obviously gotten any because I haven't played it yet. Customization, it's cool, you get to see the characters, Connie, Leland, Anna, Sunny, Julie for the victim side, and the family side, you got Letterface, Cook, Hitchhiker, Johnny, and Sissy. Now, all of these characters were playable except for Julie, Johnny, and Sissy in the, I guess, the beta. So, I don't mind any of these characters. I'm going to play as a victim. I like playing the victims more than I like to play, like, the, the killers. Uh, maybe I'll make a video where I play as the a member of the family, but for this one, I'm just going to play a I'm, I'm character from the victims. Uh, loadout, skill trees, cosmetics. I mean, you have to. I have to play to actually start getting these. So I'll jump right into it and cut to when I actually find a match. Character swap? Sure. Ooh, that's interesting. You can request character swaps. I did not know that. I don't mind at all. Okay, so I'm going to be Anna because he wants to be, that person wants to be Leland. Okay, so I did record a video playing the first time, but honestly, it was kind of too bare bones to include. And also my commentary was a bit dry because I was kind of like focused at the same time. Now I have more of an idea of what I'm expecting, so it should be fine. Um, but yeah, we'll start with this one. And hopefully it'll be more interesting. So we have the cook, sissy, and leatherface. Pretty much the same thing I had last time, although Sissy was the hitchhiker. And the previous game had all the same characters, though I was Connie instead of Anna. I couldn't even really pay attention to some of the details of the game because I was too focused on doing something else. What is this Leland character guy? Come on, man. Click on ready. Sometimes you have people who are a bit slow. But... Now, the reason I don't mind playing as someone else right now is because you do unlock cosmetics if you play them for the first time. And I do want to play all of the characters to get an idea. Now, all of these people seem to be from Xbox except for the player using Connie. They seem to be on, on PC as well, on Steam. So we'll see what happens. Um, I mean, while I'm waiting. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, so five seconds and we'll start. I did enjoy the first match I did. Yeah, so I'm gonna let this play while it loads the game. Stay quiet and hidden. Find useful items. Unlock exits. And escape the family. Okay, so here we are. This is the beginning. You always start tied. Uh, when I started, I was only with one person. I thought it was all four people. Uh, so you can hear noise already. Those are people tied on another side. Oops, I'm making a bit of noise. So I really don't want to make much noise. I just want to make... I just want to get out without making any noise. I know I'm going to be making noise later, so... Might as well. So Leyland is there. So I'm going to open this door. And I'm going to start looking for things. So... 
I am going to retrieve a bone simply because it is useful should someone come up to me. Okay, so Letterface is already here. He's already nearby. Unless I see the icon, I'm not canceling this. Okay, good. So I'm gonna keep going. So I need to find a toolbox, preferably. I'm gonna cut this down. So I can open that door. Mm. So I'm not too worried here because there are, like I said, you, well, you can actually escape through these when Letterface is around you. So you see here, this is, it requires an unlock tool. So the unlock tool you actually need to get from a toolbox, like a blue metal box as they call it in this game. So I'm going to claim here. This is very useful to escape, by the way. Okay, so there's nothing here. So I'm just going to loop around. I'm going to try to walk a little faster. I can click on A and just simply, you know, get out, but... I mean, start running, but I don't really want to alert anyone to my presence. Okay, so this is where I came from. I can hear the chainsaw. Okay, so here. Oh, okay, the victim noise has awakened grandpa. So once the grandpa... Okay, so here I have to stay still. Yeah, like this. So this guy just got is seen by the entire family. I'm not because I don't have the yellow hue around me. So I'm going to open this door. Okay. There's nothing here. So I'm going to go through this little part. So these little sections where you can like go up. Um, what ends up happening is uh, only Sissy and the Hitchhiker. Can do that. Ooh. Yeah. So I'm gonna go for the big one. Oh! Letter face is here. Let's go, let's go. My bad. So I'm gonna hide here. I am going to hide here. Oh, okay, so someone got executed probably because we were three people underneath sorry i didn't mean to cause any trouble okay i see someone running over there well i did escape the basement which is good okay so you see that the grandpa's there i want to stay away from that guy by staying away from him because if he sees you he alerts the family so you want to stay away from him the only time you actually do want to um, get near him is to stab him with a bone shard to reduce his level okay so that's sissy over there if you can see in front of me so I need to watch out because if sissy sees me I'm in deep trouble so I'm trying to see if she's gonna go away okay oh she's coming she's in this direction So right trigger to silence. Oh! I'm gonna run. Okay, so he saw me. I can't open this. So the cook heard me, but he... I think I might have escaped from the cook, which is good. So I'm going to hide here. Yeah, I'm going to hide here and try to look for something to open that gate because I need to get a tool if I want to. So I silenced the chicken, but it made a lot of noise. So I don't even think that was worth it, honestly. So I need to find a toolbox somewhere. So I'm trying to be real quiet. You know, this is the the name of the game is stealth. You really need to be stealthy. So everyone seems to be more in the basement right now. So I think I should really take this time. Oops. 
I pressed on. Yes. It says X to climb, but it's not working. What the? Your connection, your network connection has timed out. Okay, so that's a problem. <laughs> that was fun, but it was a problem. Okay, so I'll cut to the next game I play. Actually, this is something I need to bring up while I'm here. When I was trying to join games before, like after my first game, it wouldn't let me. This little error would pop by, something about credentials. So from what I've read, it's not something that's really fixed right now. Again, it is kind of day one, so there has to be a patch. It's kind of normal, all things considered. But yeah, so I'll cut back to when I actually get another match going. Okay, so here we go. This is the second attempt for uh, the capture some gameplay footage. So again, I'm gonna be quiet about this because I really don't wanna alert. See, that person over there is making a lot of noise already. So they're gonna be focusing on them, most likely. All right, so me and Connie. I'm gonna open this door. There's already a health bottle. So I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna try something, something else, you know. So I wanna try to find a, a toolbox. That's what I'd like to find. Is this a big version? Okay, so there's a little one. So I'll probably take the little one. Ah, perfect. So here's a toolbox. So we're gonna go here. Same thing, you wanna be quiet. Oh, that makes noise. So I could use her ability, but I don't want to do it now. I want to do it later when it's going to be a little more riskier. Okay. So I need to find a door first, a locked door. So I'm going to open this. This makes a lot of noise, right? No. Okay. So we're good here. So we're going to go in here. Okay, so here I need to be careful because they do tend to pop. So I hear Letterface. I hear his chainsaw. He does tend to pop up around this area, so I need to be very careful. So I'm going to pick this lock. Again, same thing. You want to be careful with the noise. And you put it in the direction. Like this. So it's a, it's a slow, tedious process. And it makes it a bit more tense. So he's like really close. Shit. Is he right behind me? He sounds really close. Oh shit, he is. Okay. I'm gonna run. I am going to run because I do not intend to die right now. Okay through here so we can't enter here so at this point I'm safe um okay so that was good that was a good escape I panicked a bit too much and ended up breaking the lock so that was really bad so I'm gonna open this Just gonna do it slowly but surely. No need to rush. Okay, so let's crawl here. Now I'm not familiar with this map, obviously. Oh, family woke grandpa. They're giving blood. I don't know where to get blood. I guess it's from us, like from when they're killing us. I'm gonna take another of these. Keep grandpa. Oh shit. Well. I don't think he saw me. I'm gonna take this bone bone thing instead of the... I'm making so much noise. It's so easy to make noise. I figure Connie would be the best one for this. Anna makes a lot of noise. Okay, so someone escaped from the basement already. 
I'm a bit too slow. Oh. Someone's getting attacked, so while that's going on, I'm gonna escape. Okay, someone j is getting murked right now. So, I'm going to go here. Okay, so yeah, someone got executed. I don't know who killed him, but I could see it from afar. Leyland is here. I think that's how you say his name, Leyland or Leyland. Better face. Yeah, I can hear more towards my left. So I need to find items. And what's good is that there's someone near me, so that's going to be... What's that? I'm going to crawl here. I'm going to stand still. Yeah. So, <laughs> no use moving like this. Now he's level 2. At level 3, I think it doesn't matter. So you really got to be careful. I might go and stab him. If I can. Okay, so I got a valve. That's going to be useful for one of the escape routes. Now, where it is, I have no idea. Ah, okay. So it shows it over there on the map. Well, on my sights. Seems pretty far away, so I really need to be careful. It's pretty... I think it might be downstairs, actually. Ugh, I really don't want to go downstairs. I really want to find a way out. Okay, so... I don't see anyone right now. It's pretty quiet. It's a bit too quiet for my taste. Oh! Leland is over there having fun. I don't know if there's someone near him, so I have to be careful. Hide. Hide. They're coming. Okay, I'm gonna hide right here. So, ooh, someone silenced the chicken. Okay, so there's both of these guys. Can they see me? While they left, shit. Fuck me. They saw me. I'm going to escape. I'm running. I'm running for it. Oh shit. This is bad. Ah! Oh my god! Give me a well somehow. Ah! Oh, that's good. He has to break it. I'm going in the well. I'm going in the well. Fuck it. I'm going in the well. I might be retreating, but at least I'll survive. And no one can come with me, right? Okay, so... Um, now maybe I could focus on the valve, but I do want to use this. Okay, level three, this is not good. Oh man, this is so tense. This is the first time I got chased by all three people. Normally I just get chased by one, maybe two. When I hear that chainsaw, it like creeps me out, puts me on edge. Okay, so I'm equipped pretty... I got some pretty good equipment right now. Nothing that would help me out defensively, mind you. What's that over there? So maybe around here is where I could find the valve?
Okay, so they're gonna look at him, not me. He's getting murdered. Anna, thank God you're still alive. This is an intro place. I don't know what I'm doing, so don't follow me. Oh, fuck it. Pressing A by accident, okay. So we're only two left. There's nowhere to hide, okay. So they know where I am. So at this point, it doesn't matter. So I'm gonna get chased for sure. I don't know where they are. That's the problem. Run. Run, get in here. That helps me out a bit. I don't know where Sissy is, so. Oh, this is good. Okay. He's gonna do a loop around. Oh! Ah! Not good, not good. No! Sprint! Oh, I'm so weak. Shit. Ah! Okay. Ah. Uh, no. No. Let me escape. Ah. Okay. Yeah, Sissy is. I feel like Sissy and the Hitchhiker are tougher to escape. Jesus Christ. I think she's nice enough to let my body down. It's all good. No worries. Yeah. So we were a bit doomed on that. Uh, they leveled up the grandfather too well. Now, I don't know how this person is going to escape. Um, did, okay, well, she is near. Can she open the door? No, because I had the valve. I would have needed that. Ah, oh, shit. Well. Uh, <laughs> you, you should just run in the sewer. I mean, in the, in the basement. I'm just running in the basement. Ah, it's over. It's over. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Oh. Ooh. All right. Well, the family. Interestingly enough, the first game I played. I watched the other spectators, well the other survivors, there was two of them left, and they were in dire straits but the grandfather was not at the highest level yet. Now this sissy player seems to be the more advanced one, her level was a little higher. But I'm level 3 so that's pretty good. So I'm getting some stats. Honestly, I had fun, you know, getting around and, and learning how to do things. So that was pretty good, I'm gonna quit. So that's it guys, this is my video for the Texas Chainsaw Massacre playing as a member of the family. It's just to give you guys like a first impression. There's a lot of those videos out there, there's probably better comprehensive ones. But this is just more like a, you know, from someone who's never really played a game like this. Except for literally yesterday when I played Friday the 13th. I don't really play much survivor horror games, I've never gone into them. Um, not, not for a, a lack of interest, it's just because I didn't 
I was playing other things and back then uh, when they first came out my PC was not very good so thankfully I can still run this kind of decently and uh, I had a lot of fun I enjoyed it you know there are moments where I don't really talk it's just because I'm kind of like getting into it but uh, running away is kind of tense having to press on it's very simple I like that the game is simple but it's a lot of fun I prefer fun simple games like this and I feel like if I played with friends it would be even more fun like if we actually like communicated with each other and stuff it could be really really enjoyable so I'm really curious to see how this game is going to pan out obviously there's some issues like I said connectivity issues but it's not nearly as bad as any other like there's a, most games online when you start playing there's connectivity issues but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed watching this I had a lot of fun playing I might make a video with a member of the family if someone requests it I'll do it but um, I think I'll just play this game on my on my lonesome for now but yeah so that's pretty much it I'll catch you guys in the next one